guys and welcome back to my channel so today um i have a special video and this is going to be me trying a headband wig for the first time i have never tried one but i've been seeing them go around and they look pretty cool and whatnot and before i start i do have a top on i have on a strapless top but yeah so i saw these headband wigs um going around and they look very interesting and they look like they will be great for like on the go so this wig i'm going to show you guys is from y wigs and i let them pick out whatever wig they wanted for me um to do a video on and the wig that they sent me is a very 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 natural style kinky curly wig that kind of like matches my natural hair pattern honestly but it's very very curly and it's short and it looks very natural so i'm gonna get ahead and show you guys what it looks so like so the wig is from y wigs as you can see and this is what the wig looks like so y'all i have never like seen one of these in real life so i was like kind of shook when i saw it it's very very interesting so this is what the wig looks like and I'm gonna get closer so you guys can see it better. Okay, so this is what the wig looks like um, when you get it out the packaging. It is very, very kinky curly as you can see. I have not washed it or anything. I didn't want to because I want to show you guys what it came at, what it looked like out the packaging. Um, so at the top, you have a comb there. And then you have two combs on this side, adjustable straps. And then the cool part about it is this headband has like this Velcro that you can put on. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on um, and see what it looks like real quick. Okay, so this is what it looks like when I first put it on. And it is very, very kinky, you guys. So you're definitely going to have to play around with this wig. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take my spray bottle and spray the wig through and just get it so it's not like as defined and I'm going to pick some of the curls out and I'll be back with the headband on so you guys can see what it looks like complete. All right, you guys, so I'm back with the final look and I will say um, when I put that wig on at first and saw like how tight the curl pattern was. I was like, oh my gosh, is the wig going to stay like that? Like, what is it going to get like looser? Like, what's going to happen to it? Because I was very, very scared. Like, I didn't know how it was going to look. Um, yeah. So, that spray bottle, like, literally saved this wig. So, what I did was I put my wig on the mannequin head that I have. And I just took a spray bottle and it saturated it in water um just for time purposes i would have co-washed the hair first but you know co-washing hair letting it air dry takes forever and this is the type of hair that would be best to have it air dry rather than like use a diffuser and yeah because it's already like tightly curly and short so yeah using a diffuser probably isn't the best thing to do with it but um yeah so I just saturated the hair with my spray bottle as I was spraying it I was taking my hands and like finger combing it I did not use a comb or like a pick or anything I used my hands and I finger combed the hair while it was wet um in the roots there are still some like tightly curly curls in there um which I will probably have to get to when I do co-wash it but I think it looks amazing right now it looks very very natural and it's so crazy because this is literally like the same curl pattern the same length as my natural hair and it's very very natural state so I thought that was pretty cool like even when I pull the hair um like my hair is this long and this is how long the wig is I just think it's so like amazing and easy the only different thing the only thing that's different is that this wig, of course, is fuller, fuller than my natural hair. I have really fine natural hair. If you guys could tell from the beginning of the video when I had my hair slicked back, um, that's after I took my hair like out of cornrows and it had a whole bunch of products on it. But my hair is so fine 
it gets straight and like can slick back very easily and then my edges have been doing so much better you guys like if you go back and look at old videos like all the stuff I was doing to my hair like all the manipulation I was always doing to the front of it like really damaged the front of my hair and yeah so my edges have always been super fine but throughout the last few years they got even more fine and like thinner because of all the stuff I was doing so I've been taking really good care of them and growing them back so this is a great protective style if you guys do not want to do your hair at all and by saying doing nothing to your hair I mean like literally just put your hair in a bun and put this on so uh, like I said the wigs did come with different headbands so this is one of the headbands so I decided to put this one on because I was going for like a little chic like boho-ish look I guess with the natural hair and I have these cute little leaf earrings I put on and I just thought it was super cute so it came with this headband and then it also came with this yellow headband right here um yeah so the front of the headbands do do this like cross tie thing so you have to be very precise when you do put the headband on so the black part does not show um so yeah so I think I did pretty good with that and then it comes with another one and a lot of these headbands remind me of just like a tribal print like laid back boho-ish look this is the other headband right here I think this one would be really cute with like a black outfit black dress black bodysuit and some accessories so yeah i'm gonna give you guys the details about this wig all right and the wig also came with this wig cap which i did not use i really don't use wig caps like that so i just put it to the side um let's see the wig is from y wigs like i stated um the name of the wig is mary 14 inches natural color um, it's a headband wig and the cap size is average and yeah the wig I think is around $140 I would say but I think it's worth it because it's very very easy to manage and it's like great if you're like on the go like if you're at home and you have your hair like looking crazy and you just want to go to the grocery store or whatever real quick it's super easy to put on. Um, and I just love how natural it is like this is like basically my natural hair and I do like the like headband the black headband part of it because the back is elastic has like elastic in it and it has the velcro yeah velcro little straps in it so you can adjust it to how tight you want it it feels very very secure on my so head. since this hair is super big um you can get away with putting your hair in a slick back ponytail um for other wigs that are more sleek like a straight headband wig you might want to like braid it or pin it or something like that so it won't have that hump in the back but yeah so you guys also i have a code you can use the code morgan just my name for money off please let me know what you think about this wig i think it's super cute at first i was like what what like what am I supposed to do with this because it's so tightly curled but after I played with it it came out super cute um, I'm gonna co-wash it and see how it looks it'll probably get a little bit longer but yes you guys please let me know what you think about this wig do you like it would you try it have you tried a headband wig I think it's a really cool and great idea for people like on the go that do not want to do their hair so yeah please let me know what you think i'll leave all the info linked below at the bottom and i'll see you next time you guys bye